Hello there and welcome. I'm Machine Dana. I hope you're having a wonderful, great, great day. So yeah, Twitch has released a new feature. It's in closed beta at the moment. I got an invite to this link like three or four days ago. Basically what it does is highlight when a first time chatter first posts a message in your chat. This is quite an interesting feature that Twitch are adding here. It just means that you're able as a streamer to really, really see the highlighted message of someone that's first joined your chat. And it enables you as a streamer to greet the first time chatter pretty much in immediately because it is highlighted. There is one small problem here. It kind of does feel like you're getting a subscription or some bits or something like that, but it's not. It's just, it's just a first time chatter, but so if we just put the confusion aside for a second and think about just the benefits here. Obviously, someone newly joining your stream could be nervous. They're joining a brand new community. They're browsing around. Perhaps they're looking for new games to watch, new friends to make. Maybe they just want to feel part of a new community. And often what can happen, especially in the medium to larger size streamers, their chats can get missed the first time round. And obviously, that's quite a bad experience for most people. I think most people are mature enough and experienced enough on Twitch to realize that there's quite a lot of things that are going on. There's a lot of things that a Twitch streamer needs to manage. There's audio, there's gameplay, there's chat, there's lighting, buttons and keyboards and mice and a million other things. And, and I'm just talking about basic streamers here. There's some streamers do some really extreme things as well that even add more complexity to that. So it's really easy to miss a first time chatter. So in this video, I'm going to give you a bit of a flavor of what that looks like. And I'm also just going to show what the feedback is from the community for this feature. It's a really, really short video. This one, I just wanted to show the new features to people that may not have received the closed beta. If you do find this useful, hit the like button because, you know, I love you if you do. And subscribe if you want. And if you want to ask me any questions or come hang out in my stream, I stream most days at twitch.tv forward slash machine Dana. Let's do this. So interestingly, when this first happened, the first time chatter was somebody that had watched my YouTube videos. He jumped in the stream to say hi and introduce himself, which you're more than welcome to do yourself. He was obviously just saying hi. He didn't realize that he was going to be the first ever person to experience this first time chatter. Now from him, and his perspective, he wouldn't have known any different. But on my screen, this was highlighted a lot like the subscriber highlight messages are. So I was able to see this straight away. And obviously, this was my reaction to Hype Kingfish. First time chat. For Wait, what? Hype King! Yes! Hype King! Right, okay. I need to. I just need to record this. Do the first time chat. Oh no, it's there. It'll be in chat. It'll be on the VOD. The first time chat. I love your videos. They're so helpful. Guess what, Hype Kingfish? Guess what? You are going to feature in my next video all about first-time chatters on streams. I hope you don't mind. I don't really care. It's not your choice. It's my chat. <laughs> so, Hype Kingfish, shout out for featuring in the video and thanks for being a part of the experiment that you didn't know you was going to be a part of and that nobody else has access to because it's in closed beta. And Anyway, so a couple of points about this. But it's really, really good that Twitch are adding these new features, which are just basic quality of life features you don't always see on other platforms. Things that would just improve the viewing experience for the viewer. Obviously, that viewer will have got a great greeting, whereas a viewer can sometimes not even be greeted at all. It's very hard sometimes to keep track of new followers, new viewers, particularly if those people are not regulars. For example, maybe they came into the stream six months ago. You had a bit of banter with them and maybe they've been busy with stuff and they haven't been on your stream for six months obviously that never happens on my stream because all of my viewers are there every single day so it just gives a little bit more of a heads up to the streamer and obviously in the case that it's a new viewer it just gives a little bit of a better experience to the viewer now, i'm really looking forward to twitch making these quality of life improvements i did actually make a previous video specifically about tips to improve your engagement with the chat on twitch these are like a list of tips and advice that I give specifically designed to help you as a streamer improve how you engage with your chat. So this obviously helps that, particularly if they roll it out. And I have a strong feeling they will roll this out very soon. Obviously, at the moment, it's currently just in beta. I don't know why I was selected, but it appears like quite a few other people have been selected. And actually, when I clicked on that notification, it dropped me into this page here. So Twitch has a feedback forum service here where you're able to add comments about how they can improve Twitch chat. So this is the first participation. Some creators will notice a few first time chat highlights is now available in chat this feature lets creators and their mods identify and welcome newcomers in the chat to their community when appropriate so this is also something that is visible to moderators the highlight is only available to creators and their meds and mods in the chat and it's not displayed to the rest of your community so that's quite cool it just means there's a little bit more etiquette about it i would say by not showing it to everyone else in chat now it does say that you can toggle the feature on and off in the chat settings under first time chat highlight but having looked on the channel here 
on the chat settings here. I'm not able to see it anywhere. And even under chat appearance settings, I don't see it here either. So maybe that's just a bug or something like that. Overall, the feedback from the community does seem to be pretty positive. So far, about 400 comments. Pretty much all of them are positive comments so far. I like the first participant highlight a lot because I don't like to unsee new viewers who try to chat with me. I think that's his way of saying... He likes to see them. Someone else reflecting the comment here. I love this idea, but I don't see the option to enable this in my chat settings, but I look forward to seeing this becoming widely available. An amazing thing. Great feature, especially my bad memory. See there, this guy. This person knows, man. <laughs> if you've got bad memory, you'll probably find this feature really useful. Interesting comment by this fellow here, Baby F Nelson. Very good addition. This allows me to target those individuals and make sure I engage them a lot more. <laughs> Why is he targeting them? So unfortunately, I can't show you exactly what it looks like because I said I was recording it and it doesn't show up on the VODs. So I would need to interrupt my stream to actually record a screen recording of my own stream manager. And it's just a boy and a fuss to do that. But it does just look like a subscriber highlighted message. So there you go. Hopefully you guys found this useful. Very quick, short video all about the new first time chatter feature from Twitch. Really, really good that they're adding these quality of life things. I look forward to a lot more of these from Twitch. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and have a wonderful day. Take care. I don't know how to go down. I just want to, I want to go down. No. You have to buy uh, to go down. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> no. Get a whole thing. Get a whole thing.